Hi, RAS. This is my homework from the in-service on February 18th. This is just a quick video for all of you who are beginning this video making journey. These are just a few things that I've learned along the way. So first of all, um, if I'm using the program Camtasia, which is on my computer and any of you are welcome to borrow it to make a video. What Camtasia does is it records your screen. And so anything that you see on the screen is re being recorded right now. And it then also it does the voice. Um, it is great, it, you, it works very well with PowerPoint. When you use PowerPoint, uh, Camtasia will automatically launch. So it's a great program, I've used it a lot. Um, but there's just a few things, this is like Katie's helpful video making hints. So the first thing um, is that you want to watch out for your personal information that you have on your screen. Because most of these recording programs are recording your entire screen. Uh, so for example, um, I have, on, I made some little sticky notes that say no personal information. Um, I know a lot of us use this sticky note feature for just different reminders, but let's say that you had something about your personal life on here or something about a specific kid uh, with some specific name and some information. You don't want any of that on here. So you wanna make sure that you take off anything that is personal um, that should not be out there for everyone to see. The other thing that you should probably watch is if, for example, you have tabs pulled up. Um, this is my work email and ooh, there's my personal email. So that's something I probably don't want kids to see. I probably don't want them to see my work email either um, based on there might be some confidential information that we've all shared between us that other students don't need to see. So you wanna make sure that you, you watch what, um, what tabs you have open. And then the last thing is to watch what icons you have over here um, and to watch the busyness of your background. So the other thing that can be personalized is of course your background image, such as what I have here. And so that's kind of busy. I might wanna make it just the plain windows background for a video, or I will also wanna make sure that it is not um, a picture of maybe my family and I, or a picture of um, you know my husband and I having a beer or something of that nature. So you wanna make sure that that's a very neutral thing and that all of these um, icons, that they're nice and neat over to the side, they're not all spread all over the place, um, and that they also do not contain any personal information. Um, and then probably the last, I guess this maybe is the last thing, is watch what else you have open on the bottom, because um, you could accidentally click on something. Um, and so depending on what it is, you may not want uh, students to see it if you accidentally click on it. And here is, I talked about in the in-service about my script that I wrote for some of the beginning, so I just thought you'd get a kick out of seeing it, that this is how much time and effort I put into this in the beginning where I actually wrote a script and that takes way too long. Maybe do it for your first video or two till you're comfortable. After that, don't worry about it. So there's the phone. I got to answer it. I'll talk to you all later. Good luck.